And coming up next, our main event, a matchup for the UFC middleweight division title. So here he is, the number one middleweight contender getting set for this 185 pound title fight. He believes this title shot should have come a long time ago, but he has let bygones be bygones. The focus now, unseating the champion in dominant fashion and starting a new middleweight legacy of his own, 25 minutes or fewer away from becoming the new champion. We will see how he performs tonight. martial arts athletes of all time. And in order to preserve that goal, this is a title defense, simply put, that he's got to have. for this, our main event of the evening. So these fighters are just a year apart. Some differences in height and reach. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas! It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Middleweight Championship of the World! Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 26 wins, 5 losses. He stands 6 feet 1 inch tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Presenting the challenger, Sean Strickland. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, only professional record of 24 wins, two losses. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Ladies and gentlemen, the reigning, defending UFC middleweight champion, Israel, the last style bender, Adesanya. All right, this is for the UFC Championship. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times, on a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, match your coins, do not fight. when you break down. There are no weaknesses in these guys. These guys are as well-rounded as they come. They both can wrestle, both can grapple, both can strike. They can do it all. And these are the matchups that we dream of as MMA fans. Big, powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Well, he is at his kickboxing best tonight. Another nice, good series of kicks by him. There. I mean, the kicks are coming in bunches. Normally, it's the hands. Tonight, he's going kick after kick after kick. Nice job to land the straight punch there. Must be nice to have that kind of reach advantage, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Right under the elbow, the body keep playing. Oh, 
big kick land. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Big knee to the body. Good takedown defense by Israel. Now he's got the more time for And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. It won't take many of those. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for Israel Adesanya. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Just out of range with the big right hand. Throwing that jab, no good. Oh, beautiful display on the feet there by the champ Adesanya. You haven't seen many guys that have come from straight kickboxing and done as... Oh. Pretty tight, DC. I'm no Brazilian Jiu Jitsu black belt, but maybe not good here. No, it looks like it's getting in deep. Oh! Now he falls back into the finishing position. Wow. All right, right into side control. Upper body strength figures to be put to good use here. Yes, absolutely. And you got to look for his opponent to turn back into him. He should chase guillotine. But the opponent turns to the opposite side. He can take his back, throw his hooks in, try to choke, or flatten him out and just go for the finish. All right, so he's sort of turtled up here. Not great body language. Perhaps he's trying to bait him in a little bit. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. All right, so a huge round for him there. Nearly had him out of there with the head kick. Did get the knockdown. Talk us through the replay. He got the knockdown. He won the round. He did everything correct. The only thing he didn't do is finish the fight. But if he continues down the path, if he continues to do the exact same thing as he did before, he will get that finish. wrestler stand up get to your knees post your hands don't allow him to get his hooks in right really be aware of the hooks but get to your hands stand up fight the hands look like it did stun him a little bit oh how about a left up and the diving punch to the head all right he's sort of hanging out here unguarded dc not sure if he's trying to bait him in or what but not great body language here by right, closed guard now. You gotta be careful though. He's got a lot of submissions off his back. All right, so you gotta be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't wanna mess around for too long. Oh, trying to pass here, but Dikembe Mutombo style, he gets denied. Block! Great job blocking that pass by the bottom fighter. Might be a submission attempt here, Chad. I mean, you cannot. Oh, it looks like he's transitioning to an armbar. Yeah, he's trying to switch over to get an armbar. He's going to be on his corner to try to chase him. He's going to tag armbar here. Oh, he picked. 
picks him up and slams him down. A big explosive slam to lift him and slam him out of that armbar. Go right into side control. Now let's see what he does, right? Sometimes when you do that, the choke or the yes. submission can get tighter, but he was able to evade it. Yes. Man, this is some serious ground and pound here, DC. He's not just staying busy for the sake of staying busy. These strikes are doing that. Oh, yeah. No pity, Pat. That is it. Oh. And there comes the stoppage. He's done. He's done. What a fight. Oh, absolutely one for the highlight reel right there. A tremendous kick to spell the end of the night for his opponent and for him, I should say. But just caught him flush, full force, beautiful extension on the kick. And... The fight was really over as soon as that one made contact. I'm not even sure he was conscious when he hit the canvas. Outstanding performance here tonight. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. From me, calm now with no mash from me. Stay away from these ashy utes for they come around and get ash from me. That's 5,000 capacity, 5,000 capacity. Then spread that over the UK. E, I got girl in my inbox selling me eyes. Living on the edge to the end of our lives. Wolf in the sheepskin telling me lies. Sometimes I love when my enemy dies. So ahead of my time. Mainstream boy starts letting off lies. We can never, ever, ever level in price. Take that fee and then treble it twice. Yeah. The problem's back, I got flow. 